This is the darkest part in my house at any given time. Hence, I put a motion activated lamp here. It's the Xiaomi motion activated night light or simply called Xiaomi night light. However, I decided to install a lamp here that turns on when the area is dark and turns off when there's light instead of a motion activated lamp. Una sa lahat, mag-subscribe muna kayo sa aking channel para suportahan ito. You may also join this channel as a member to avail of exclusive perks like priority in comments reply and early access or exclusive access to some videos for members only. You can also help fund some projects here by sharing super tanks. This is the original version of Xiaomi's Nightlight. It's a plug-in type, meaning you just plug this into any AC outlet and it will turn on if the area is dark. This is not a smart device since it has no capability to interact with other Xiaomi devices. In fact, there's no connectivity function here. It uses photo sensing to activate its light. My unit is branded as Media because this is the Chinese version. It has soft warm light without the harmful blue light which is ideal for bedrooms. It uses 3.2 watt LED modules that could only consume 0.4 watt an hour. This means if you use this for 24 hours straight, you only consume 9.6 watts or it will take you at least 100 days to reach 1 kilowatt hour. Aside from turning on automatically if the surrounding is dark, you can manually turn on and off the lamp by touching its face panel using your hand or foot. You need to touch the media logo if you want to activate the lamp manually. It won't activate if you touch the surrounding areas of the logo like this. It should be on the logo. You see? And on the logo to turn off. The photo sensor is located at the top portion. Hence, you should plug this lamp on the wall with the sensor at the top position or like this otherwise the photo sensor performs poorly if you do like this where the sensor is below i plug in the lamp sideways with the photo sensor on its side so if i open the door to let the light comes in it will not react and also if i turn on the light it will also not uh, reacting. Maybe because uh, the photo sensor should be on top or on the vertical position as the instruction have said. Just like in other Xiaomi devices, it's all white and the material is made of durable ABS plastic. The two prong of the plug uh, here look uh, sturdy. And you can turn on this light uh, even if there's light uh, in the surroundings, turn on and turn off. And let's test the sensor. Let's cover the sensor. And let's turn on the light. It turns off. The lamp doesn't take up all space on the AC convenience outlet by design. Since this is already an old product from Xiaomi, it is only priced at over 200 pesos in several online stores. Unlike what sellers of this night lamp said, the brightness of the lamp is not adjustable because it has no control whatsoever except for the on and off touch switch and the photo sensor. The brightness of this lamp is good for bedroom while you are sleeping but not to illuminate this area like this. So my purpose in buying this device has not been achieved. Maybe I need a bigger lamp. So in the meantime, I am retaining here my Xiaomi Night Light 2. It's over 100 times brighter than the plug-in type. Check my previous video about Xiaomi Night Light 2 with the link above and in the description below. This channel has also a playlist of Xiaomi products that I have reviewed and used at home. If you like what I am doing, please support this channel by subscribing. Dagang salamat ako si Jun Tariman. Hi Tech, bye!